We cannot complain about the world, how bad it is. This world remains bad. This world remains demonized. This world remains depressed. This world and they continue having abortions and they continue doing their agenda unless somebody says, I'm going to do my part to shine my life. And there's a time it's going to start with my family. We're going to rebuild our family. We're going to rebuild our church. We're going to rebuild the altars of prayer. We're going to start over this thing and we're going to make an impact in our world. Hallelujah. What's worse than being blind is having sight but no vision. Sight is looking at a three-month-old baby and seeing a three-month-old baby. What vision is is looking at a three-month-old baby and seeing a Moses that's going to go and kill a Pharaoh. Seeing a Moses that's going to go and lead his people out of Pharaoh. We don't look at the chapter two of teenagers. We look at them and we speak chapter three. That right now you don't look like you're going to serve God. But let me tell you something. One day you're going to serve God. The old season you depended on the rod of Moses. The new season you depend on the ark of God on the shoulders of the priest. The old season it's all about the man of God. The new season it's about the people of God. The old season you get delivered from the enemy. In the new season you gotta exercise dominion over the enemy. The old season you gotta endure suffering. But in the new season you gotta engage your enemy. In the old season you complain and you whine. In the new season you gotta get circumcised from complaining and whining. In the old season, you get stuff from the Egyptians. But in the new season, you got to give stuff to God. In the old season, you wait for God to split the Red Sea. In the new season, God waits on you to step into the River Jordan. The new season, you don't wait in the upper room and say, Lord, we will not go if you don't go with us. No, no, no. God says, I will not go if you don't go. A shift of mentality. That means I pray for the sick because God waits for me to pray for the sick so he can heal them. We cast out demons because God waits for us to cast out demons so he can drive them out. We step out in faith because God waits to back us up. Remove this Egypt mentality where you're a slave, constantly waiting, constantly being a victim. Poor little me because in the new season you gotta be a soldier, not a slave. Move from deliverance to dominion.